Good evening. It's estimated that around 5,000 people marched through Birmingham today to protest against extremism and terrorism. Three separate demonstrations were held in the city centre. It prompted some pubs to close completely to avoid trouble. Stacey Foster reports. They say they're simply football fans who want to put an end to terrorism and extremism. This was the True Democratic Football Lads Alliance in Victoria Square. By far the biggest of the three protests to descend on Birmingham today. It was led by Villa fans in support of the victims of the Birmingham pub bombings. We're against all forms of extremism. Uh, we're labelled as obviously far right, which is nonsense. Our logo is, it's not about left or right, it's about right and wrong. You, you, you'll see in the crowd there's people of all creeds, colours, religions. At the second demonstration in the second city, one man received a hero's welcome. Tommy Robinson was the former head of the right-wing group the English Defence League, which has held marches in the West Midlands before. He was supporting the Football Lads Alliance. That's a different group to the ones in Victoria Square, but with a similar name and similar objectives. Too much immigration from Islamic countries. We're starting to lose our identity here in the UK. We're sick and tired, basically, of extremism being brought to the shores of this country more than anything. Uh, I believe we're a Christian country and we abide by them principles. Standing up to the, uh, to the establishment, there's a lot on them. Uh, the establishment don't like them, but they are peaceful uh, and they are getting the point across. All we're doing is standing up for what's right and what's wrong. Yeah. All I'm going to say is have a good day, respect the city of Birmingham, let's do it right. After a rally, the group set off on a march into the city centre. Football fans from clubs across the country catching the attention of shoppers going about their normal day, stopping them in their tracks. A wall of police officers prevented the group from entering Bullring, where, just on the other side, a counter demo was being held. Our message is that whether you're black, white, gay, straight, trans, if you're young, you're old, you're Muslim, Jewish, whatever religion you follow, why can't we stand together, live together, and live together in a place of safety? Police officers from across the country were drafted in to assist the West Midlands force today. Officers say it passed off peacefully and no arrests were made. Stacey Foster, ITV News, Birmingham. Three teenagers have been arrested.